Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We decided to do the shell readings today. So we're going to be doing that and then pulling out three cards from, uh, I forgot. Oh, this is the planets, um, the planets, what is it called? I forgot. Sorry, you guys. Um, the numinous uh, deck. I apologize for that. Anyways, let's get into your reading, Pisces. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of August 2020. Pisces, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys. Okay, Pisces. Everything or every doubt that you've ever had up until now, um, whether it be trying to move forward, whether it be trying to start new endeavors, if you've been incurring a lot of blockages or difficulty or resistance, that's quickly going to be removed. I see you guys being able to swim your way into uh, your future. So what they're showing me here is there's no resistance at this point in time for those of you guys that are trying to get jobs now is the time to do so you will and you're more prone to finding a job that you're supposed to be doing at this point in time for others of you i see you guys um really trying to start something different whether it be going back to school whether it's completing school something that is going to help you and assist you for the future so now is the time to really bring in your energy and really focus on what you're trying to achieve. I do see a lot of new beginnings for you guys, not just beginnings, but I feel that there's like finally a feeling of relief. There's no resistance. There's no like difficulties to overcome. I think August is going to be substantially uh, a very blessed month for you guys, whether it's falling into alignment whether it's uh, being around people that are very supportive, that are very positive for you. Um, and for those of you guys that have or have been have been having difficulty in regards to your relationships or even, you know, with family, uh, if there's been any like communication that's been strained or you're no longer talking to someone that is from your family because there is a misunderstanding, that's quickly going to uh, be coming up for the month of August, but I feel that there's going to be some, uh, some healing that's involved in that situation, being able to have an open to heart conversation where you're able to be completely honest with each other, but also provide healing for one another to be able to mend fences is what they're saying. I do see, um, I do see for some of you guys, there's going to be an opportunity that comes to you that is very unexpected. It could be an invitation for some of you guys, those of you guys that are single. It could be a person that comes to you and is completely honest and lets you know that they are emotionally invested in you and that they want to get to know you better. It could be an invitation like wanting to take you out to dinner, wanting to, you know, just spend time or be around you. Um... And it, like I said, it comes very unexpectedly. Now, for those of you guys that are in a long-term committed relationship, it could be that you find out that someone has a crush or has something going on uh, with you, even though uh, you are in a committed relationship. It may come as a surprise to you. So very good news for you guys. I'm going to be pulling out three cards from this uh, deck here. Wow. Okay. All right, so you do have the sun card. Blessings coming your way, unexpected blessings, being, um, essence, energy, self-awareness, life force, spirit, creativity, honor, masculinity, uh, distinction, uh, ego, individuality, solitude, expression, self-sufficiency, shine, heartbeat, father. So these are all the energies that represent the sun. But what they're saying here is that there is unexpected unexpected blessings coming your way and for some of you guys it could be in matters of the heart as you guys can see here in this deck we have a heart right at the bottom where is it right here 
and uh, this is you know i feel that it's like joy that's coming to you uh, for some of you guys it could even be the news of uh, a pregnancy or someone being pregnant or someone in the family or your son your daughter um you know having some type of uh what's the word i'm looking for like um giving you the information that they're pregnant or something like that you also do have aries the radical so you may be dealing with the fire energy aries uh it could be a sagittarian or it could be a leo type of energy as well as we do have fire energy and what they're saying is active self-starting daring fears assertive fiery exhilarating innocent on a mission bossy uh driven uh courageous selfish macho impulsive argumentative uh competitive as well but what they're saying here is again if you can see in this deck the woman uh, has a heart and you can clearly see it here so i think that the news or the blessing that's coming your way may be in matters of the heart uh pisces now you also do have the 10th house reputation the 10th house is all to do with career in your professional sector and finances uh, career responsibilities achievement competence fame uh notoriety uh standing authority figures legacy purpose uh, pinnacle the patriarchy empire what they're saying here is again um a lot of these blessings that are coming your way may be in matters of the heart while for others of you it could be that you start to experience um a bountiful type of energy of a lot of abundance a lot of opportunities for growth and self-fulfilling type of growth where you start making money doing something that you really enjoy or you love doing uh, it could be a hobby it could be something that starts off just as something fun and is actually bringing uh, or giving you more opportunities for money for income for growth itself so definitely uh, follow through with that and um, again keep your mind and your heart open Pisces for those of you guys single out there don't be surprised if love comes knocking on your door all right my lovelies i hope you guys enjoyed this reading like share and comment and we'll see each other soon bye